As a resident of the Rio Grande Valley, a region of Texas that borders Mexico, I always thought I understood the disparity that came with the border. This thought I had was proven wrong on September 8, 2023. That day, I volunteered for an event called the Great American Cleanup. When I arrived at 9 a.m., I and others met at the University of Texas, Rio Grande Valley, Brownsville campus, just minutes away from the Mexican-American border. The volunteers there greeted my friends and me and gave us supplies to clean up the trash. They gave us hand sanitizing wipes, sunscreen, water, gloves, and most importantly, a trash picker. After that, we hopped onto a shuttle that took us directly to the border. This is when I was proven wrong. Upon arriving at the border, I saw many clothes in the barbed wire crevices, separating the U.S. from Mexico. I then saw piles of garbage on the ground. When people cross through the barbed wire, they sometimes left behind their belongings, such as their IDs, clothes, and even pets. This caused the trash to accumulate and take over the entire area. While picking up trash, my friends and I noticed a young man from across the border trying to get our attention. Hello, he said, waving. I gestured back at him. He then picked up a trash bag, threw it into the river between the U.S. and Mexico, and yelled, Vamos a recorger mas basura. This translates, come pick up more trash. I stood there baffled. How could someone mindlessly litter like that? I thought to myself. My friends were also shocked, but we decided this meant we had to work twice as hard now. The rest of that morning, we worked together to get as much garbage picked up as possible. Before we knew it, the afternoon approached and our shift had ended. Sweaty and exhausted, we exited the shuttle and returned to the university. That day, I left the university happy, knowing I could help the environment and make a difference. People need to understand how significant the littering problem is at the border. And I hope that I can participate in another cleanup in the future.